Hey, what up, guys? This is Doctor Man Thirty Three, and uh, in the last episode, we were in the middle of doing Snowy Mountain, and we we're going to continue that. So uh, we did get that one power cell on top of the, going through all those explosive box areas, if you remember. And I gotta sneeze. Hold on. Uh, I apologize for that. <laughs> it's probably gonna be really loud. Anyways, um, and now I just went to find this last, the last guy. This guy you have to kill. So I just quickly went to go there without so you want wasting any time. So there it is. That was part of killing the last. I'm not sure what the hell that guy is called. And also a coffee. And I took a shower. So. Oh, look at that silver. So I'm good. I'm still not sure what the hell that's for, though. Oh. So it makes sense. <laughs> that felt really good though. I am drinking coffee, so I do apologize. Ah, coffee is so good. Especially my I'm not sure if anyone knows, but if anyone has like those Craig machines or mine's a Tassimo. Those are like the best things in existence. I got one for Christmas. Oh Jesus. And it's like been the best gift I've ever received ever. <laughs> Pretty much, not gonna lie. I use that thing like every day. There's a lot of good stuff out for it too. I'm not sure what's like more like if there's more stuff for the Tassimo or more for the Craig or whatever it's called. But I love my Tassimo. There's green tea, which I love to drink green tea. Fuck, I keep. Um, there's hot chocolate, which is really good too. Really nice because it's also. Canberry, Cladbert Canberry, however you say that. So, it's really good chocolate, and yes. I'm also um, Tim Hortons coffee, which is like, the best thing. I think that's part of that deal. Well, one of the best things. Probably thinking, like, what the fuck's Tim's Hortons coffee? And, uh, well, it's Canadian only company that sells, like, really cheap coffee. A lot cheap, but, like, Really good, affordable, really good coffee that's really affordable. Pretty much exactly what it is. Like, uh, you can get like an extra large coffee for like less than two bucks, I think it is. Like, all the coffees just under two bucks. You can get like lattes and stuff if you want. They just announced that stuff kind of recently, actually. So, if, if, if you are a fan of lattes and stuff like that, still. Ooh. This one. Oh, I can't. No. Name. I apologize. This is Robert. <laughs> yeah, Starbucks. I mean, like, it's not like your Starbucks coffee where like a cup of coffee costs you like six bucks or four bucks or whatever. Fuck it. You crazy Starbucks people like to drink. But like, it's just really nice, cheap, affordable coffee. I love the taste. Really good price. And there's pretty much two more ones like at every corner. <laughs> but yeah, you can get like coffees for like two bucks. So, yeah, even if you got like pocket change or like change left to, like in your car or whatever from like using a five dollar bill or whatever, it's just boom. Like hell yeah. Like why not? get like a two dollar coffee that's really good so yeah i got some of those teacups or whatever you want to call them tea tea i don't know sure what the hell they're called do i have to go back fuck i'm confused 
confused. Oh, I see. So yeah, and there's like... Tea you can get, and... Yeah, sorry, I kind of lost my train of thought right there. about it but um those are the ones i tried and yeah they're really, really good there's also like latte ones you can get which i might try one day too and also there's a chai tea one so good that is like the best one just bought some more chai tea actually yeah, just the other day that's still a bunch of tea drink the shit out of my hot chocolate though <laughs> need some more of that shit you guys like coffee or just like tea or even like hot chocolate and drink a lot of it or like to drink a lot of it would like to drink a lot of it i should say and i sadly suggest using one of these machines if you ever get enough money though if you have any extra money and you're like oh no i sure i got money i don't know what to spend it on unless you're like one of those like hardcore coffee drinkers that has like more than like one cup a day or whatever and I don't know, because it is a member, it's only one cup sort of thing, so it's not the most... For me, it's practical, because I only need to drink one coffee, cup of coffee a day. Others are like, drink like 10 cups of coffee a day. So, yeah, unless you're one of those people, it's pretty effective. It's like the best gift I've probably ever gotten. I'm not sure how much they're either. I think they're... I think they're relatively cheap. Maybe like 100 bucks, maybe? I'm not sure. You might have to look it up. Because I got mine as a gift, so... I'm not sure how much they are. When you register, too. It's so stupid, because... If you register, you can get like a free, uh... Like you can get a free some free cups for free. So that's really useful. But then they're like, oh, like how much? Oh shit! What the fuck? I need to double jump. We go. How much? Like where'd you get this? I was like, oh, I got a gift. It's like, oh, how much was it? I'm like, I don't know. It was a gift. It's like. I'm sorry, but you have to give us a price amount. I'm like, what the fuck is this shit? I, don't, I didn't buy the thing. I don't know how much it costs. You're like, please enter a freaking amount, please, sir. I'm like, oh my god, well, thanks, freaking registry place. It says, like, put, I said 100 bucks because I don't know how much the fuck they cost. And I just got it, I just got it actually in the mail recently. So once I go shopping again, I can use it probably to buy some more chai tea, that's my favorite. Or maybe some more coffee. Some more coffee ones are good. Oh yeah, another power cell! <sighs> but I, I seriously cannot say how much... Not enough of how much I love this thing. back to the one area and back to the spire cave to uh miss get some arms that we missed do a super jump like the best thing ever oh there's not even a thing up here that was Go up 
there. I missed one. <laughs> Random question for anyone that's actually watching this. Children. What's your guys' favorite type of tea? I know it sounds really like weird. Oh, I got all the arms for Snow Mountain. Sweet. Oh, and that's all seven new spy things too. Wow. Making huge progress right here. <laughs> what am I missing here now? I'm just missing activating all this retarded ass. What should we call it? These things. Sure, the last one is either. Yeah, see, this is the way you're supposed to go, so I did do this backwards. Oh, well. I almost jumped off the edge here. Or what's your favorite beverage? Okay, maybe I shouldn't say like tea exactly. Unless you already answered, but yeah, guys in the comments, what's your favorite, uh, like hot beverage sort of thing? Besides like coffee, don't just say like coffee or whatever. Want to know like tea, what type of tea, or specialty coffee? I guess has to be specialty coffee for you to take coffee, like a latte or something like that, or a type of latte, like a gingerbread latte. I don't know. <laughs> Chai tea or whatever. Yeah, just say whatever your favorite kind of hot drink is. And if you see something like, I've never drinking hot tea or something, I will find you and I will slap you. Because you drink probably some sort of hot drink in your life. Even just hot chocolate. <laughs> This place was a lot easier to 100% than the other places. See, I got all the power cells. All 20 of those, 20 of those, and all 7 of those. Well, I literally just 100% of this place. This was a lot more easier to do than freaking other places. Alright, so we're gonna go back quickly to the. Can I skip this anyway? Pause it. <laughs> Pause. So we're just gonna head back to the spider cave quickly to pick up the last 12 precursor orbs there. And then we're gonna head back into the place to where we got here in the first place because there's one hidden orb apparent cell out there. So we're gonna do that next after. And yeah, that's pretty awesome. I think we just pretty much almost beat this game. We're like 91% done this game, guys. <laughs> and that's even 100%, so we might be a bit closer to being the game. That's only maybe a few more episodes, so it's pretty exciting. <laughs> I might have to... I might be starting my next let's play sooner than I think I am. Yeah, once... I didn't... I think I thought it was going to be a lot slower at this, like... Be more... Like, out... Goddamn computer. Like, uh, doing this only, like, once in a while. 
but like once you just get into the game, it's just like hard to stop, you know? It's like, oh, I don't want to stop playing. <laughs> Need to keep playing. Alright, so back to this freaking spider place. Don't want to be here anymore. Sadly, we do. Oh. I know exactly where we have to go. It's kind of weird, because you have to really figure this out on your own. Like. You have to put two, 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 uh, two, two, two. You have to put two, 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 two together. <laughs> you have to put two and two together to freaking figure out this. I'm like, I'm slowly falling into the black eco. Dark eco, I mean. Yeah, see now, this is open. And I still failed. Yeah, I'm just gonna go down. Uh, don't even care. This is not working as well. So I'm gonna get the freaking place out of here and get this little freaking level. Fucking motherfuckers, fucking motherfuckers. There are so many guys, it's like hard to freaking even aim this thing because it locks onto everything else. Oh, right there. Oh, I must have picked up the other ones automatically. So there we go, we now 100%ed this freaking spider cave area. So now we can get the fuck out of here. Get out of here, don't want you. So yeah, guys, this is 100%ed every single area so far. I can smell the finish line, the victory, victory line. I just want to get the fuck out of here. This place is too creepy. Uh, I didn't seem that creepy before, but now I'm in here. I'm like, I don't want to be here. Get out of the way. Spider cave is creepy. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, I'm gonna wait for a cart. <laughs> Alright, so we have to get back to how we enter this place. Which I think is over there. Which we're gonna commit suicide again. Wee! Oh, yeah. Alright, so we need to get out of here. Not that way. Before I go in here and start talking to them. Which I think that's what's to trigger the last area. Or whatever. Get that back. And do this fun course again. Yay, joyous. Oops, wrong button. <laughs> Press start one. We activated the other what do call it vent to use. I'm surprised I even got through here like my first time through. Well like I know I hit a few of these, but like at the end here. I didn't miss like uh, yeah, see the one right there. Oh boy, oh balls. Fuck. Oops. I didn't surprise me hit any of these, and I still won the race or whatever. Get to the end of time, sort of thing. I should probably take my time in here, but I'm just too. Like, come on, guys, do something. I can feel the energy run through me. Oh, jeez, let's not fall down again there again. Okay, we're good. <laughs> Awesome, can I fire rockets? Dude, then they do. Right, 
I think they implied this in the other attack games, but it's like the only area we can actually use this. And it's not even ne necess necessary either. You can just totally bypass this and miss this. <laughs> if you're not going 100%. They should have implied that more often, but... Alright, I think I'm gonna actually end the episode right here, guys. I know, I'm sorry, but... We've now 100% in every single area. Got every single orb and got everything. And we're gonna go talk to... Whatchamacallit. And maybe... This might even be the last episode of the game. So, yeah, guys. Have something to look forward to. Hope you guys enjoyed, and next episode, maybe possibly finishing the game. Thanks for watching, guys.